to Embry Mill. Embry Mill is a master plan community um, developed by Newland in Stafford, Virginia, and we have seven home builders for you to choose from within the community. Haley, what is a master plan community? A master plan community is a large scale residential neighborhood uh, that has many amenities for the residents to enjoy. And who are the seven builders? Uh, our seven builders are Integrity, Miller and Smith, um, Stanley Martin, Drees, Atlantic, Kahopnanian, and Richmond American. Um, aren't they open right now? They are open, um, however, most of them are open by appointment only right now. Um, so it's best to uh, double check first before you stop by, give them a call and see uh, what you can do to set up an appointment with them. Cool, so you speak of all these amenities. Care to show us? Yes, of course. So this is a map of Embry Mill. This is phase one. Um, this is fully developed now. And this is phase two. This is where we are currently developing. Uh, we are right here at the Welcome Center, and this is the model row where all of our model homes are located. So in phase one, we have the uh, Embry House right here. It's kind of the hub of Embry Mill. Inside the Embry House is the Grounds Bistro and Cafe. Um, they have a cool bar. They have uh, brunch on the weekends, so it's a really fun place to go, get to know your neighbors, and grab a bite to eat. Um, this is actually a picture of the Embry House so that you can kind of see what it looks like. On the lower level of the Embry House is a resident exclusive gym. And on the third um, upper level of the Embry House is the HOA office. Outside of the Embry House is our first community pool. Um, the pool has a splash pad for the younger kids, some lap lanes, and a water slide as well. How many pools does Embry Mill have? We actually have two pools, and I'm glad you asked, because our second one uh, is here in phase two. It's brand new. Um, this is called the Night Meeting House and Pool. Um, so the Night Meeting House is a clubhouse for Embry Mill residents to reserve. And the uh, pool at that clubhouse has another water slide, lap lanes, and a splash pad as well. So moving on with our amenities, uh, we also have 15 plus parks and playgrounds throughout Emeryville. Um, some of them are serenity parks, which are just nice green grassy areas. Some have um, playgrounds and some have fire pits, such as Heritage Park, pictured right here, um, is our first community fire pit. Um, Festival Park right here has a large outdoor amphitheater where we host movies in the park, magic shows, tons of really fun, family-friendly events. Uh, so you just mentioned events. What other events does Embry Mill have throughout the year? Embry Mill hosts two 5Ks a year um, in partnership with the Jeff Rouse Aquatic Center. Um, that one is in around Halloween time. Um, the second one is around Christmas time. Uh, we also host a summer blowout event. Um, at Embry Commons. Um, we host a cornhole tournament. Um, it's a fundraising event that we host every year. Um, and then, of course, other events such as movies in the park, magic shows. Um, we have a really fun event called Characters at the Cafe, where we bring in some princesses and princes, and they can have cookies and tea with the kids at the Embry House. You said movies in the park. What is that? Movies in the Park is hosted at Festival Park. Um, so we put down a screen. The movie is projected on that screen at the amphitheater. Um, it's a huge park, and there's a really nice green grassy area um, across from the amphitheater. So that's where everyone can bring their blankets and just lay in the park under the stars and watch a movie. Cool. So you spoke about um, playgrounds. Can you point to a few of the playgrounds yeah. at Embry Mill? So we have a top lot right here outside of the Embry House. It's fenced in, of course. Uh, we have another playground here at Embry Field, which also has some soccer uh, nets. We have a, another top lot here outside of Dogwood Dog Park. Um, another playground in Aspen Field in West Walk. And right here 
here by Emily Commons. Cool. You mentioned um, a dog park. Mm -hmm. How many dog parks do you have at Emory Mill? We have two dog parks. Our first one is here in phase one called the Dogwood Dog Park. It's divided into two sections for large dogs and small dogs. And there's even a little uh, doggy wash off station if their paws get muddy so you don't have to bring that mud home with you. And our second dog park is right here in West Walk and it's brand new. It's a beautiful uh, fenced in dog park in West Walk. Are there any other elements around these dog parks or is it just a dog park? Yes. Uh, so outside of Dogwood Dog Park is a community garden um, where you can grow fresh herbs, tomatoes, whatever it may be. Uh, and outside, well around the Dog Hill Downs Dog Run Dog Park in Phase 2, uh, we have a play structure for small kids, we have some slides, and a second community um, fire pit. Awesome. So what is to come at Emory Mill? So this section right here is where we are currently working on. Um, the roads were just paved, so the lots will be available there soon. Um, it's more single family homes, as you can see. However, this section might look a little different, and that is because this is where our live, work, um, commercial apartments are going to be put in. Um, so essentially, they will be townhomes with a commercial space on the main floor and um, live, living spaces on the second and third floors. Um, moving on this way, this section will be our last phase of Emory Mill. Um, again, more single family homes. And then this section right here is our 55 plus active living age qualified section. <laughs> And what is age qualified versus just 55 plus? Age qualified means there just has to be one person in the family um, that is 55 years old or older. And will they have their own amenity? Yes, that will be located right here. And it will be a clubhouse that is strictly only for the 55 plus residents. And then are there any new amenities coming on online? Yes. Um, this over here is going to be a fun bocce ball court with a covered pavilion. Um, and then of course we'll have even more parks and playgrounds and trailheads throughout the community as well. Okay, so now we have some frequently asked questions. Okay. Um, what is the HOA fee for Ember Mill? HOA at Ember Mill is $125 a month and that covers trash and recycling pickup snow removal, um, and access to all of the amenities, including the resident exclusive gym and the two community pools. Okay. Um, the one thing I did see on the map are a whole bunch of trailheads. Can you speak to that? Yeah, so we actually have 10, about 10 miles of trails within the community. Um, there's trailheads in phase one and in phase two, and we also have a fun Jurassic Park looking trailhead along my road that you'll see as well. Um, you can stop by our welcome center to pick up a trail guide um, if you want to go out and hike these trails. Fun fact about the trail guides, they are unrippable and they're waterproof. So it's the perfect trail guide to take with you on any hike at Emory Mill. Are you sure they're unrippable? Pretty sure. Oh, wow. I mean, I'm not, <laughs> I don't hit the gym that often, but <laughs> I can't rip it. So. That's awesome. <laughs> Um, is Emeryville near any of the commuter lots or VRE stations? Yes. Uh, so this map right here actually shows you um, where Embry Mill is located um, in terms of the VRE line. So as you can see, this square right here is a um, VRE station. Um, and we also have a commuter lot uh, right on the other side of the 95. Um, and we have a lot of federal and military employees living at Emory Mill. Um, so this also shows you where those um, military bases are located in terms of Emory Mill located right here. Cool. So the next question is, what are quick move-ins? Quick move-ins are homes that we have inventory of in the community that are already built and ready to be moved into within 30 days. And you can find those posted on our website. 
So I, you mentioned that there's a lot of military and federal people living here. Mm -hmm. um, or is there any special incentive? Is there anything that you guys do for them? Yeah, so each of our seven builders offer their own military incentive, so you'll have to give those builders a call to see what they're offering. Um, but as the developer, Newland offers free lawn care to deployed service members. Wow, that's really cool. So overall, Emory Mill is an amazing community in Stafford, Virginia. Um, it's new home construction, but there are resales in phase one, two, if that was something you were interested in. Uh, we have a huge family focus, we're very pet friendly, we're kid friendly, um, and everyone is just so, so neighborly. So check us out. Um, you can uh, go to the Welcome Center, we're open seven days a week um, from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. And again, just call the model homes before going there just to set up an appointment due to everything going on right now. Um, and lastly, if you have any questions, you can comment them down below. And uh, until 6 p.m., and one lucky winner who asks a question will win a $50 Amazon gift card. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you soon. Bye.